Hey guys and girls, and thank you for watching another episode of the Xbox Tester. My name is Maurice. Today we're getting a look at Taxi Life, a city driving simulator on the Xbox Series S. And you know what? Let's just dive in. First of all, let's see how much data this game is, and that's 5.2 GB. The game's not on Game Pass, and I think it's like $39.99. Yeah, pretty standard price for a game like this. It's fully optimized for new gen consoles, Xbox Gen 9, Gen Scarlet. And uh, you know what? Let's go uh, start it up. You guys, if you like this kind of content don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel it means a lot for me you're really helping out the channel you can also hit the bell icon i upload almost on a yeah daily basis new games old games updates on games sometimes even a little bit of hardware here and there so taxi life a city driving simulator it's actually quite a funny game. I, I've been enjoying it thus far. It's, yeah. Whoa. I think somebody hit me already or something. No. <laughs> um, yeah, the game runs incredibly smooth. It's, um, it's, from what I can gather, it looks to be still Unreal Engine, um, Unreal Engine 4 with some Unreal Engine 5 stuff going on. And it's not a really high resolution. I think it's somewhere in the range of like 720p, maybe 900p. But it is most of the time 60 FPS. It's actually quite a, yeah, decent ride. I did a frame rate test like you can see right now. And uh, overall, not a bad experience, I must say. I was really enjoying this. Laura Mitchell. Oh, let's uh, pick her up. It's not a bad game at all. Also, by the way, big shout out to the people at Nacon for sending me a key to this game so I could test it out on my channel. And... Um, yeah, it's a uh, not-so-crazy taxi. <laughs> I think that's the best way to describe this game. It's pretty straightforward and, yeah, overall, quite a well experience. The world is great. It's uh, in Spain. And uh, there is some pop-in, of course. But then again, we're playing this on a uh, pretty cheap console of course but there's a lot of stuff going on people walking around lots of cars driving around and uh, yeah overall just a really good experience there's people sitting and eating I think it's Barcelona this map is, by the way, it's gigantic. Look at this. It's a gigantic map. And I think it's even bigger. It's really, really big. That's what she said. Um, yes. Let's get going. I'm not going through those stupid little streets. I hate those. Yeah. I think we can drive 70 around here, if I'm correct. Otherwise, no. See, there are some stutters. But I got the same thing on, on my PlayStation and on Xbox. So, yeah, it is what it is. You know, this could easily be... One of the best looking cities I've seen in a game in a long time. It's a really big open world. And yes, there are bugs. 
I 100%. The, the, the AI of some of these cars is just horrendous. How many times I've been hit from behind is insane. Look at that. <laughs> Some of these cars really have a death wish. And of course you can also drive from inside of the car. There are no other graphical options. And yes, you can play with mouse and keyboard if you want to. I think. Well, at least the, the camera works with, with the mouse. And I think the others too, because there's like an option in the game settings where you can... System settings. Yeah. There are no graphical options, so this is it. There's no 30 FPS option or anything. This is literally it. These reflections look good. Do you see that? It's actually quite insane. Almost looks like uh, ray tracing reflections. I know it's screen space reflect, but it's really good. For a Series S game, yeah. Bye. Bye. What did we make? Did we did? Did we do well? Yes, we did well. <gasps> we didn't got a tip. That's not very nice. You can completely design your car, buy new cars with the money you make, and um, yeah, make a whole taxi imperium. It's, it's actually quite well done. It's way more fun than I, I expected it to be. You can even find like uh, little Easter eggs and. and, and um, yeah, all kinds of stuff. Points of interest. I'm having a blast with it. And this is a perfect game for everybody. You know, this is one of those games you can play on a, on a Sunday and it's relaxing. Nothing too much strange things going on. I love it. Now, come on, green. Yeah. Not completely how you should do it. Yeah, that's dark green. Yellow is dark green, right? Yeah, I think so. Move! They see me roll. It almost feels a little bit like those, uh, those French movies t from Luc Besson. Taxi. And if you never watched it, don't watch the remake with Queen Latifah. It's horrendous.
Thanks for the ride, I guess. That wasn't really good. Two. Wee. Only two stars. Only watch the original with. Uh, if I'm correct, if correct me if I'm wrong, Sami Naziri, I think. And and uh, of course, uh, what's her name from uh, the Christopher Nolan movies? Uh, that's where she became famous. Uh, what's her name? She played uh, Talia Rash Al Ghul in the. Uh, Batman or the the Dark Knight Rises. She's also in those uh, those movies. He's like the boyfriend, or the girlfriend of him, or something. Why am I talking about the taxi movies? Yeah, okay, I'm tired playing playing a taxi game. Go watch those taxi uh, taxi movies. The first two, three are pretty good. After that, meh. Not that much. But, yeah, you guys, this is Taxi Life, a city driving simulator on the Xbox Series S. And, uh, yeah, all in all, really fun game. Uh, way better than I expected, to be honest. And definitely worth the 40 bucks. Thank you for watching. Hope you had fun. Hope to see you guys soon in another one. Bye.